Hey everyone, I'm finally back from a little bit of a hiatus. I'm going to be playing a, as usual, a brand new just released uh, scene game. They have chosen O De La, I think how you pronounce it. Um, so I put the um, information about the game in the description, so go check that out. And let's play it, see what it's like. A uh, new game, please. Enter your name. Uh, lovely. Adbots. That's me. New game. So, uh, if I don't know where, I'm a girl. Child. Whose, uh, parents have gone away. So I'm on my own in my own house. No spend time for Adbots. Aww. Little Adbots. They naturally remember the routine their parents taught them to go to bed and sleep well. Where is Mr. Bunny? But where is their fluffy rabbit? Adbods is easily scared and needs their cuddly toy to reassure themselves. Oh, it's there! I can see it. Mr. Bunny! There it is. Move AL. AL? What? That? AD. Oh, Alright, okay. Their fluffy rabbit in hand, Adbods has the courage to leave their room to brush their teeth. Yeah, go brush your teeth, little girl. Jump space, jump! Jump! I always jump when I'm going to brush my teeth. Where is the... where's the... Oh, there you go. You gotta click the doors. You turn on the hallway light by pressing the switch. Pick the first floor and the floor on the right. Okay. Light on. It's locked. What? The bathroom door isn't closed. Why would it be closed? Why is the key on the ground? Oh, yeah. Get the key, little ad buds. You need the key. Open door. It is completely reassured that Adbots passes the hallway and enters the bathroom. It's dark. Oh no, indeed it is dark. Adbots rushes to turn the light. Or turn on the light to feel safe. Yep. Mr. Bunny, help me turn on the light. Yep. Great, thank you for your help. Yeah, Mr. Bunny, you rubbish. Adbots being very fearful. We decide to check all the possible hiding places in the bathroom to be sure that there is no hidden monster. Yeah, um... Ooh, want to check the cabinet? Have to climb on the toilet? Alright, okay. Climb on the toilet? Up on the toilet? Oh no, I can't seem to... Open the drawer? Nothing in there? Ooh, the mirror. Ooh, nothing in there. That doll looks a bit creepy. Well, there's a monster behind the curtains. Flicker done, do it, flicker. Oh, it's flickering. Ah, uh, so, oh, it was, oh no. Well, the light's gone out. I get up there. How do you stand on the top? Oh, okay. There we go, guys. There's no one except Mr. Sucko. Who the, who the hell is Mr. Sucko? Hi, Mr. Sucko. Finally appeased, Adbots brushes their teeth. Brush, brush. Okay, I think I'll stand on here. Adbots has finished. They are a model child. They now return to their room. When they leave, they don't need to turn off their lights, as all the lamps in the house are automated and turn themselves off after a certain period of time. Awesome. I still turn the lights off, though, but whatever. Um, back to bed then. What was that? I saw something around, guys. I saw something around. It is in peace that Adbots returns to the room. No monsters here. Put the light on, just in case. Adbots notice that the blinds on the window are still open. They have to close before going to bed. Let's close. There we go. I saw someone. Oh, did you? I didn't see anyone. Adbots' imagination is certainly running wild. As there is, was, of course, but the slightest sign of life in sight. He was right there. Behoo! Adbots being extremely fearful. They again decide to check all possible hiding places in their room. Doing so, they reassure themselves that no monster has sneaked into that room during their absence. Ah, uh, pick in the drawer. Nothing there, nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. Wardrobe. With their mind at ease, Adbods is finally going to bed. We are safe, Mr. Bunny. You got a lot of creepy dolls in this room. 
Good night, Mr. Bunny. Sweet dreams. No, I did that, guys. Finished. No monsters in here. The next evening. Mm -hmm. Next evening? Where are my parents gone? We got it's almost bedtime, Frog Bugs. They naturally remember the routine their parents taught them to go to bed and sleep well. Here we go again. Uh. So. Oh. Oh, the. Didn't pay the electricity bills, did they? Don't see any monsters. Can you see any monsters, guys? Mr. Bunny must come with me. Okay. Sorry. Come in, Bunny. Come in, Mr. Bunny. Oh, just. Throw something out. Poop poop to you, my dear. You now have the courage to go to the bathroom and brush your teeth. Yeah, brush your teeth. Could not be any monsters. So. Definitely something wrong with his house. It's completely reassured that Adbot passes the hallway and enters the bathroom. Yep, I brush my teeth, I remember to do this. Light on. Always light the room. And of course, it's way more convenient. Oh, we check all the drawers? Locked. That one's locked. Nothing in there. Can't be out in there. Back here. And Buzz remembers exactly what to do. Night again, no one is hiding in the bathroom. Good, good. What we like. Brush teeth. Little lad bots. Brush your teeth. I can still taste the toothpaste in my mouth. Yay. The teeth shine with their whiteness. Brandy white teeth. My teeth. It's locked. But now we're done. We don't have to turn the light off because it turns itself off. Um, yeah, nothing. Light on. Like, like, floors or something. I'd probably calmly walk back into the bedroom. Right, let's see if we can see anyone outside this time. Well, there is. Look, the monster. There is someone at the window. I'd probably hurry to close the blinds. Run, you I'd close the blinds. Hi. No, don't say hi to it. <laughs> this old girl. Oh, he's gone. The parents always forbid them to talk to strangers. Well, that was definitely a stranger. I didn't do it on purpose. And Bud's therefore displayed by saluting him. The parents would would really not be proud of the... What? Lauren said hi. The insolence deserves punishment. Well, the parents, should, the parents shouldn't have left me, should they? I've been a bad mother, a bad father. With shame, and Bud checks that there is no one hidden so they can go to bed without anxiety. Okay, that's locked. Um, I think I got Bridget. Well, oh, there's nothing, nothing out there now. I think no, no. I probably would we'll never be able to sleep if they don't make sure that we have a chicken. Nothing. I don't see anything. We sleep. Good night, Mr. Bunny. Sweet dreams. I think there's something suspiciously wrong with Mr. Bunny because he always ends up. Those bedtime, they actually remember their routine. Another, another one. They removed all my toys, did they? Maybe, maybe your toys are alive. Here it is, here is a deserved punishment for our bots who disobeyed by talking to strangers. Yep. They have to listen to me, the voice in their head that reminds them of their parents' instructions. After taming their insolence, our bots continues their routine to sleep well tonight. But I am not very tired. But without talking back, they take their fluffy rabbit and go to the bathroom again. Our parents left me for three nights. I was finally listening to the voice of reason. The blue toy gives them emotional support they need to leave the bedroom. However, they know that as they grow up, they will have to part with it. But, um, close that. Oh, no monsters. Um, yeah, we're all good. It only concerns Mr. William me. I'm gonna brush your teeth. Brush, brush. No monsters. What's in that room down there? Now it's not time for a walk, as the parents told them they must go to sleep. Alright. He's very obedient, this child. Everything is going wonderfully. Thanks. Put the light on. Hello, Mr. Don. So we check these drawers. That's locked. Okay. Nothing in there. Oh my god! Jesus. Do not let me catch you making such hurly burly again. We will pay the consequences. Oh, it was a monster. 
did not make noise at night in order not to disturb the neighbours. He decided to stop behaving like a naughty scout and go brush their teeth. I am Robert, you are or whatever you say. Yeah, we're fine. It's just a monster. Um, check up here. Nothing there. Um, brush teeth. Yeah. You're really proud of me. I've, I've never brushed my teeth so many times. Very good, little lad buds. Uh, nothing here. I can't wait to go into the storage room. What's at the window today? Nothing. The altercation with the monster allowed and boss to face their fears and mature enough to go to sleep without their fluffy rabbit. Drag the item out of the inventory to drop it. What item? What item? Out of the inventory. I don't know what you mean. Do I have an inventory? That? What's that? Why is that going to keep changing? I don't know what you mean. I would like to draw a lot, they would have to wait till tomorrow because it's bedtime. I don't know what you mean. We just do. Oh, the light's gone out. I think we really need to fix these lights. There we go. I don't, I don't get it. I don't want to need this. I don't, oh my god, it's that was there again. Oh. No monsters, good go to sleep. Do that, Mr. Body, sweet dreams. Even though I had an inventory. Someone said that you can't even be bothered so <laughs> to play that game now. You would dread that I was realised the consequences of their actions. You dread who is dread. He didn't follow me or listen to me. The voice in their head is sounding apparent. Blah blah blah. I grew up. He says it. Blah blah blah. blah. Mr. Bunny, open drawers. Yeah. It's locked. Okay. Put the light on. I like to. Yeah, you like toothpaste. What? what? Really is a monster or a hallucination to the guilt of their discipline. What? What the hell? I don't, I don't want to go back to my bed anymore. I'm not tired. So many questions, so few answers. Okay, so I'm gonna... Alright, oh, okay, I can't disobey. I can't go in there yet. Storage room. Hey, here we go, back in here again. Nothing. 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 Brush teeth. Yeah, brush Mr. Bunnies. Yeah. Okay. You remember to decide not to listen to voice in the head anymore. They decided to cooperate for the survival. He had no choice, but the time was running out. The parents always told him to go to bed when he had the nurse around. Can I go down here? He will find you. First check, they must check that there is no one sitting in the room. Close blinds and turn off the light. Okay. Is it? Oh shit, what the fuck? Uh. Oh, frick, I died. I don't know why I died, but I died. Oh man. Well, that was Old Dela. Very interesting game. A lot to read. A bit repetitive, but. Be interesting to see where it goes. But uh, that's it for today. Um, thanks for watching. If you want me to play any more, let me, let me know in the comments or something. I'll play a bit more of it. Um, pretty good game. I liked it. So, see you next time. Bye.